Hello, and welcome to the channel where the lunatics have well and truly taken over the asylum. Send help, please! This has got bad news written all over it. Now, if her plan was to hammer herself into the ground, then she gets a 10 out of 10. But even the dog runs around to tell her that she's a fucking clown of epic proportions. I'm not sure which VR game asks you to charge and face smash your enemies. Ouch. Side flip, beautiful. Internal bleeding, incoming. Oh, call an ambulance. I'm fucked up, bro. Halloween's just finished, but Thing from the Adams Family just can't help but fuck with this cat. What a bastard. When I realised that this person was wearing a black bag, it dawned on me why she can't get into a car like a normal person. She's a fucking idiot. This is next level balancing on a makeshift snowboard, but then he gets shit whipped into the middle of next week. That's why hipsters don't snowboard. It's not every day you wake up thinking that you'll end up with a big wooden post up your ass. But here we are. Bleeding rectum, anyone? I don't even surf, but I can tell you that her foot placement is dog shit. She slips off and then decides she wants to be in a washing machine just tumbling around in the water. I can feel a spectacular dive coming from this guy. He heads forth and right in the dick. I was wrong. Well. This is one way of getting rid of those stubborn clinkers and dingleberries. He comes in hot, loses control, and wham! He actually bounces off the concrete. Boing. Oh. Use a warning. Keep the slide wet when sliding, or suffer plastic burns like this dipshit. He tries to power through his mistake with his bowling shoes on and dismounts into a scorpion. Meathead diving, he can bench press 300 pounds but can't lift his fucking feet up. Turd. The quickest way to see your dentist is to do this. Almost knocked the ginger out of his hair. He spots his friends and starts to skip down the hill like a little lamb. Unfortunately for him, he's picking up way too much speed and... Wham! Face full of sand. He finally gets his bearings and sheepishly walks over to his friends. Pole vaulting over a river on what is essentially a fucking twig. What could possibly go wrong? That. And his friends have fallen on the floor laughing at him. Oh dear. This has got all the hallmarks of I'm the man and I can do it written all over it as he throws the TV over his shoulder, literally. And now he looks at the mess he's made. Dick. 